All right, guys, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how to, to process your parts from the SSA, or at least see what's at the SSA ready for you to pick up. I mean, you can process them if you want, and I'm gonna show you how to process them, but um, this is VLO6i, so make sure that you type it in right, because even though we say VLO6i, it is not VLO6i. It is VL06I. That is a zero, not an O. I got that mixed up so many times trying to type it in. That's not even funny because everybody calls it VL06I. But everybody, I don't understand. Even in the military, we understand that O means O, the letter. And then zero is how you talk about the number. So, I mean, go figure. But either way. Uh, it's not difficult and then when you pair that in with AIT it's even easier because everything is there versus having to use all those different T codes you can just go back and forth between each tab or if you want to use Z issue versus what is it I whiskey BK and then process your parts that way I mean everybody has their own battle rhythm and how they do it and some people just like being stuck in the past so let me go ahead and show you how to do this and get off my soapbox. All right, guys, for this one, we're going to VLO6I. That is V as in Victor, L as in Lima, 06I as in India. For this one, we're going to go down to For Goods Receipt. I'm going to click on it, and then we're going to Put in our S loc. Hit execute. And this will give us all of our stuff. We can change the, the view here by clicking on header view or item view. Item view just gives you a description of what the part is so that you know what it is. And then as you can see over here, you have a lot. Most everything is duplicates. So you want to click on one and two that pulls both of them as you can see I honestly cannot tell you why it does that if you see here pretty much everything is identical and at that point you're gonna post goods receipt and then you're gonna post goods receipt and this is the time now this is something you need to do before you leave your SSA uh, it's not really hard uh, as you can see it's fairly easy to do but that is it and then after that you will go into Z issue. All right, so as you can see, it's just like anything else. There's nothing difficult about it. I mean, the biggest problem I see on a normal basis is parts showing that they're ready for pickup, but they're actually not. Or there's parts in your bin that haven't been processed and they want you to take them even though they haven't been processed. Makes a whole lot of sense, but it happens. Trust me, it happens. It happens to everybody, happens to the best of us, or maybe it's just me. I don't know. Either way, uh, hopefully you got something th from this. Hopefully it teaches you how to use some of this stuff. Um, if it did, give me a thumbs up. Let me know that I'm doing a good job. I like that pat on the back. Everybody looks like good old boy. A good boy pat on the back, pat on the head, or rub like a dog i don't know whatever it is you want to call it if you didn't like it and you thought it was stupid just make sure you hit the thumbs down twice so that you make sure you hit it good and uh if you have any more questions or concerns or if you have another way to do this same thing as there's always two ways to skin a cat in g army uh let us know in the comments below and if you have not subscribed yet I wish you really would. We're trying to grow this community so that everybody gets this information and the more people we bring in to get this information, the more chances of somebody else that doesn't have it is to find it because one, word of mouth, and then two, because of YouTube and its infinite wisdom of algorithms. Uh, yeah, I think that's enough. Um, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.